Hey yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back, Hibu 3HD Reactions. We're back here with some more Vinland. Some more Vinland Saga, you feel me? Episode 20, bro. We're getting close to the end now, it seems like. I swear, I hope they already got a second season planned, man, because this shit is so lit. Like, god damn, I can't even lie, man. Like, this is one of the few... The fuck? One of the few animes I'm actually looking forward to every single week, bro. Legit. As soon as I see it drops, I do a video. Straight up. Like, this shit dropped, like, maybe a few hours ago. I was out. I came back home. I saw that shit came out. I was like, yo, download. Like, what do you mean? We got videos to do. Shit. But I just came up from uh, the hype that is One Piece. So I'm ready for some Vinland definitely right now to see what's going on. We got a huge coalition going on right now. Maybe not huge, but it's pretty big, you know? We got Askelon and, uh, you know, Thorfinn and Thorkel all on the same side now. Like, it's about to be some sh crazy shit about to go down. Bleh. Excuse me. So we're going to just jump straight ahead into 20 and see what's going on next, right? Let's do it. Let's do it up. Oop. I don't want to miss anything. All right. Wait, what did that say? I missed it. I'm sorry, guys. January 2014. Fuck! Hold on, I gotta pause it. January 2014 AD, outskirts of Gainsborough, Northeast England. Jesus, they moved across that so quick. How do you expect me to read that? Think so? Well, you'll be surprised. Yeah, he's fucking surprised. <laughs> Utterly shocked, actually. Want to fight? I'll fight you. <laughs> He didn't believe it. Askelan. Oh. That's bullshit. That's not what you heard. Oh my god, that glare! Yo, the prince has truly changed, man. Oh, I can't wait to see how he... How he is uh, in front of his father and his brother. Oh, I can't wait. The new prince? Yo! It's gonna be interesting. He's a different person now. Yep, 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 definitely. Oh shit! Yo, his pops is gonna be like. Nani? I might have chosen the wrong son. Drop the beat! Uh-huh. Look at- Yeah, that's the prince that we got right now. I was wondering, too. Eh. Thor's... Eh. 
Oh my god, I can never get over that slam. Oh, I'm beginning to understand what I just saw right there. With Asklan following the prince off into the distance and them both like dissipating. There's a huge message there. Aha. <laughs> oh, fucking Thorkel, bro. Ooh. He already decided an assassination is the best route. What about the brother? But wouldn't they have to wipe out the brother as well? <laughs> no, he has a he has a soft spot. For Thorfinn. I swear, it's just like Kingdom, you know? The upcoming king. king. Ah. Okay. Yo, he, I mean, I know this was, I know this was obvious, but he's completely changed. I'm willing to turn into a demon. Wow. So the, the old prince is dead. That, that nigga you guys knew about earlier on, he's fucking dead, bro. This dude's a completely new character, a new... Oh shit, here we go. This is what I was waiting for. Let's see. He wants to see your eyes. Oh, they're planning to kill him here? Wow. Yo, just like that, he wants to wipe out his son. No matter what. The first who draws his sword loses. So he plans to win this with rhetoric. Interesting. 
Yo, this prince, man. Oh, shit. I'll be able to tell what type of king he is, right? <gasps> there he is. Kneel down. He he got close enough. He knows. His eyes are tired. Is this who the King of Danes is? He was, but he's ready to find a successor at this point. He really was. He's not lying about that, that's for sure. We're here to kill you. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. He sees. So he's going to convince the king here that he's the one to take the throne over his brother. Just like me. Flashback. That's an interesting statement. I agree. The crown does not want you. That's your son, bro. I mean, it's not anything I haven't seen before, but damn, bro, like, to be able to make such a decision cold-heartedly? You're underestimating Ascalon and Thorfinn.
Huh. The one with the silver tongue. Oh, he didn't like that. Hold yourself. Yo, he's fuming. He is fuming. At this point, I think uh, Askeladd is going to make a plan to kill the king himself. Just for that comment. Just for that comment, bro. Askeladd is coming for his head. But his... Yo, his... His blow... Yo, his restraint... Yeah, you definitely did provoke him. <laughs> I will show him how to use it. Wow. I mean, this was a very intense meeting, bro. Wow, that shit made my own blood boil. God damn. <laughs> 57th. Oh, he shaved. Oh, he's only 23. No way. Even I did not recognize him at all, bro. And I'm pretty good with faces. That's crazy. <laughs> Wait, did he ask if he can kill the king? I'm sorry, let me go back.
Hmm. Interesting. Can you eat? Hmm. Yeah, Ragnar's dead. Shit. How do you just casually tell somebody their brother is dead, bro? Like, come on. I mean, does he have no empathy left? His empathy's gone? I mean, Ragnar was his most trusted retainer. I don't want to say he doesn't care anymore, but like, there should be some empathy when you tell his brother like he's dead. That's weird. Fuck, man. Shit. God damn. Yeah, his arm was fucking broken, if I remember. Completely broken. He <laughs> remember when he posted up, he was like <laughs> <laughs> Eat that. <laughs> Bruh. Fuck. Really? Really? Bjorn's gonna die, bro. He did take a lot of injuries. That's sad. Bjorn was such a savage, man. It sucks to lose somebody like him. And die in your bed. If I see you in the battlefield, I'll kill you. Oh, ask Len, man. Actually looking out for somebody. What do you know? He's such a complicated character, bro. I love him. I love Ask Len. Like he, he has so many layers. It's very difficult to get completely understand him, you know? Whether he's a bad guy or a good guy, you can't choose one with him. He's just human, you know? Which is everybody in this show. 
You know, it's like so realistic. Everybody is just human. You know, like that's just the way it goes. You're trying to live in this messed up world, bro. Ah, oh, shit. Crazy. This episode was a little bit slow, but excuse me. The meeting with the king made it all worth for me. Made the whole thing worth it for me. You know, especially after after that coalition or the the truce between uh, Thor uh, Thorkel and the prince. It made things more interesting to look in on. You know. Now we can actually focus in on just the characters, right? Not too much bloodshed and fighting going on, which is usually what takes your focus away. But when we have these slow meetings and these big meetings, like the one with the king and then Asklen with uh, some of these other soldiers, and I'm sad about Bjorn, bro. Like, damn. Because if, if Asklen is saying Bjorn's going to die, he's probably going to, he's definitely going to die. He's probably sick from his wounds and... Back in those days, there's no hospital, right? So if you take a big wound, even though you don't die on the battlefield, you might die later, which sucks. But hey, it is what it is. But all right, guys, appreciate you tuning in with your boy, Vinlon20. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next one, right? Peace!